Hey everyone, this is Sean with Red Arrow Industries, and today I want to go over how to recover a bin from the attic. You might find yourself in a situation where you try to open up a sequence and it's corrupted, or you realize that at some point you've accidentally lifted out audio or video that you really need, and you have no idea how far back you need to go to find it. That's when the Avid Attic comes into play. There are a couple different ways to navigate to find the attic, depending if you have PC or Mac. I'm on a PC and I'm just going to go down to my Start menu, type in Avid Attic, and select it from there. You'll see folders of every project that you have on your machine. Find the project you're working on, click the Bins folder, and find the name of the bin that you're trying to recover. Once you open that up, you're going to see that you have several different save files from different times. If you're not exactly sure which one you need to recover, I suggest copying them all over to the project. Open your Avid projects, and copy all of them over. And the reason I suggest copying over instead of moving over is because if you mess up one of these or these get corrupted, then you're not going to have another one to go back to. Go back into your Avid, and you're going to see all of those backup bins come in. You'll notice if you try to open one up, you're going to get this error right here. Don't worry though. This just means Media Composer recognizes all of these bins as exactly the same. So what you need to do is close the original bin. Then you can start opening up the recovered ones. What you may want to do if you want to look at all of them at the same time is create a new bin and copy over the sequence of each backup. And there you have it, an overview of how to recover bins from the attic. If you found this tutorial useful, give us a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. And if you have any questions or want to see us do other tutorials, just comment below. You can also visit us on the web at redarrowindustries.com or on Facebook at Red Arrow Industries. Thanks for watching.